Hi, I'm Ted Greenfield with Let's Play Politics, where we take a look at the latest in the worlds of politics and football. From the Voice of America studios in Washington. Back the deflection. Oh, that's an excellent effort. In the United States, we now know who will play for the Major League Soccer Championship, the Los Angeles Galaxy and the Houston Dynamo. To get to the finals, Galaxy beat the Seattle Sounders and Houston beat DC United. The race for the White House is over, but it hasn't all been paid for. ABC News reports that presidential campaigns still owe millions of dollars to consultants, former staffers, phone companies, and so on. The total combined debt for Obama and Romney is nearly $8.5 million. The Obama and Romney campaigns have tens of millions of dollars in the bank, so they should be able to pay what they owe. The Major League Soccer Championship takes place December 1st in Los Angeles. The game is in the City of Angels because Galaxy had a better regular season record than Dynamo. The championship is a rematch of last year's final, which Galaxy won 1-0. Now that the U.S. election is over, the most exciting issue in U.S. politics right now is the so-called fiscal cliff. I think we're all aware that we have uh, some urgent business to do. But what is the fiscal cliff? Well, it's more than $500 billion in tax increases and across-the-board spending cuts that are scheduled to take place after January 1st, unless Obama and the Republicans can agree on another way to reduce the deficit. But agreement won't come soon. Congress is in recess for the Thanksgiving holiday until November 26th. And President Obama went on a three-nation Asia tour that included an historic visit to Burma. But even in Asia, he was still thinking about the fiscal cliff. Touring a Buddhist monastery in Bangkok, he was overheard, we're working on this budget, and we're going to need a lot of prayer for that. And that's all for today. See you next time on Let's Play Politics. <laughs>